Another weekend, another wave of defiance. A fortnight after China's NPCSC shut the door on Hong Kong's universal suffrage, Benny Tai and his allies continue to make another wave of demonstration before the Great Reward kicks off. Speaking before the Black Hole March on Sunday, September 14th, Ben Li Tai insists that civil disobedience is the only way forward. March set off from Causeway Bay at about 3.30 p.m. as they carry five ultra-long black clothes to express their grievances. But as Peking has already reiterated that it's impossible to overturn NPCSC's decision, so why are they still on the street? Today, 你不要用假的普選來殺我們,所以我們今天站出來是一個很重要的表示。With the slogan and banner, it's just a silent walk. Despite these regular protesters make their desperate attempt to smear the Occupy Central movement, the march was still relatively peaceful. The march finally arrived at Chater Road in Central at about 6.30 p.m., where they held a small rally there. The organizer claimed that 4,000 people took part today, but the police put the number at about 1,800. The crowd dispersed peacefully at about a quarter past seven. It may be a sense of relief for the police, but as the strike organized by the university students is due to take place on September the 22nd, the days ahead is certainly going to be acrimonious. Eric Lowe, INT.